Okay, guys, that breakfast was the bomb. But before we continue this video, before I show you guys the grocery haul, I wanted to let you guys know about this company that sells 3D wooden signs. They're kind of like lamps. Um, some have lights, some don't have lights. They have a little bit of everything. They have jewelry, they have light crystals, they have metal art. They have a little bit of everything in here, you guys. Check out their website. I will be linking it down below so you guys can go and check it out. They have a variety of options that you guys can choose from. This little bird here was one of my favorites, but I ended up going with a different one, which I'm going to be showing you guys the ones, the items that I picked out. But yes, you guys, these were very, very, very beautiful. So go ahead and check them out. Okay, so these are the boxes, you guys. They look so cute. Give animals a home. And this is gonna be the 3D wooden um, light that I'm gonna show you guys, the rose. So let's start with this one first. Look at how beautiful this is, you guys. I love the packaging. The animals here, so cute, you guys. This is the first time that I've ever seen this company. Okay, you can follow them on their social medias here. Okay, and this is what the little box looks like. So it has like this little shredded paper. It almost reminds me of like hay. This is the brand here. And let's go ahead and open this up. So I did, I was able to choose the products, um, the ones that I wanted. 
and i chose some jewelry they also do have jewelry you guys will see some in the screenshot on the side and i chose these here these are like little butterflies let me go ahead and take these out okay so these are some little earrings they're so cute you guys they're little butterflies and then we have these the ones that came with the earrings so they're like ear cuffs i think that's how you say it So you can put it like on the side of your ear. So this is what it came with, with the little earrings. And then we have one more in here. I think that's it. Oh, we have one more. Okay, so we have three here. So I also chose this little ring here, which I'm going to open in a bit. And this is the other one that I chose. So cute. Okay, so this is what it looks like here. So it's a little ear cuff right here. And then this one here is, uh, it's an earring. And then this one right here, it's like a little cuff too. So you, it's kind of like if it's hanging in your ear. I'll put a picture here so you guys can see it. But these are so cute. Let me go ahead and try on the ring. Okay, you guys, so this is a ring. It fits perfect and it's so cute. If you guys can see, it's like a little flower and a, a little bumblebee. Super, super cute. And it fit perfect on my finger so nice right so cute okay um and then right over here i chose a another ring and this is what it looks like let me go ahead and take it out from the package this is what it looks like it is so beautiful you guys it's so nice okay this is what it looks like here it is so beautiful you guys I'm loving this ring. It looks so nice. Hopefully you guys can see it right. Okay, now for the second box. This is what I ended up picking. You guys, they have some that uh, don't come with lights and some that do. And this is a 3D wooden piece here wooden carving it is so beautiful and this i actually chose a rose you guys this is perfect perfect for mother's day you know you know these months go by super quickly and again i love the presentation of the box it is really really nice it also comes with this little card here okay and again you can um connect it like look at the details inside if you guys can see it has like i think it's like little flowers or animals or something like that and then it has like a little city. I don't know. Let me turn it on. But yeah, you guys, if you guys are looking for a Mother's Day gift, this would be perfect. I would have loved if my husband would have gifted me something like this. You could use it like a little nightlight, a little uh, stand. It's almost like a little lamp, you know. Let me go ahead and turn it on so you guys can see this one. Okay, so it does come with this like little USB cord here. You can connect it to the, like the charger or uh, like me, I'm going to use a computer just because I have it here with me. So I'm gonna go ahead and connect it here and check this out, you guys. Ooh, this looks so beautiful. This looks so, so, so nice. So of course at night it would look a lot better. This is beautiful. Just this, like the whole presentation of the box is, it's a 10 out of 10. I would 100% recommend this. This is so beautiful. Check out their website, you guys. I will have the link down below so you guys can check it out. And again, they do have a variety of different things, not just the carvings, but let me know down below if you guys like this. It's so nice, right? So cute. Okay, you guys, now let's go ahead and get into the grocery haul really quick because I have to put everything away and then I have to edit a video. I'm so late, you guys, right now. It is actually, it's already noon. So, um, I had to go record in store. If you guys don't know why I did that, it's because I have a main channel and my cha my main channel consists of shopping and clearance shopping. So I go record. That's pretty much my job. Um, I went to go record in the morning and then I went to grocery shopping really quick while I was there. And then I just got home. I made myself some food, which you, you guys just saw at the beginning of the video. And now I'm just doing the grocery haul. So I have to hurry up because I have to edit some other videos for my main channel and then i have to probably hopefully have uh, at least an hour to work out and then 
I'll be picking up the kids. And also, I wanted my mom, I asked my mom to see if she can make us some mole. If you guys don't know what it is, it's pretty much like the the chicken with like the little can of mole and hopefully some rice, but we'll see. I have to go drop that off after I pick up the kids. But anyways, I uh, picked this meetup because we already have, okay, so we are in the process of moving. We're going to a different location. Um, so I don't want to buy like too much or so much meat because I want to buy groceries when we're at the other, uh, at the other place. So I did get this one just because we already have a ground beef with, which I'm not really sure if I'm going to make that one. I'm not sure what I'm going to make today, but I'm going to cook some dinner today. And this is one of my favorite meats to buy, the milanesa. One, because it's super, super thin. So it's so easy to cut. Um, and it's like really good for tacos, um, for street tacos. And then I ended up picking up some of these. I don't like to pick these up a lot, just once in a while, because it's pretty much nothing but flour. But I got these for the kids. That way, you know, if they're hungry and I just don't feel like cooking, they can just, you know, add water, pop it in the microwave and, you know, super easy and fast. So I got uh, six or seven of these, I guess. I thought I got six. Um, then I got some of this cereal. It's already been a while since we got cereal. Um, but we got the golden grams. You guys, everything is getting very, very pricey, especially like the yogurts. But yeah, I got this one here. And I ended up getting these here, the party size great value uh, cheese puffs. I was not sure if the kids would like it, but they said that they do like it. So I was like, you know what, let's just take these. So I picked some of these up for the weekend. And then I got me some tuna here. These are like a dollar, I think. I love the sweet and spicy tuna. So this is the one that I ended up getting here. Let me zoom you guys in. Whew, you guys, I am so out of breath. Okay, the next thing I got was the unsweetened almond milk, the original, and I did get the Great Value brand. I like this one. It's all right, but there is another brand. I think it's Simple Truth, the brand. It's a, uh, an organic brand, I think, that I get at Kroger. I like that one a lot better, but I was at Walmart, so I just got that one. I ended up getting a turkey breast. You guys, these went up on prices. I think the, the this is like the biggest packet that they have, and it was like it used to be like seven something, and now it's like $9.99. It's like 10 bucks. I was like, damn. But okay, anyways, this is a, let's see, a pound and six ounces. So this does last us a lot because the kids don't like a lot of, sand. they don't like to eat a lot of sandwiches anymore. So I got one of that. I got some of these sopitas just because they're very cheap. They're for like 48 cents. And you can add like potatoes or you can add carne. Like you can make a whole meal for the whole family with one of these. And it's literally like 48 cents. So I got two of these. These are the macaroni. They're like the, I'm going like the, I don't, they almost look like the elbows, I think, but I got two of these, and I ended up getting the kids the wheat bread, so they do eat wheat bread, I don't really like for them to eat the white bread, um, they honestly don't, can't even really tell the difference, like, they have always been on the wheat bread, so I got a wheat bread, I got one of these tacos because my son wanted me to make some ground beef, and I was like, you know what, let me just make some tacos for today, I think that's what I'm going to be making today, uh, today's Friday, I don't know when you guys are going to see this video, but I got some crunchy shell tacos. It's like, I guess, Taco Bell style tacos. I also got the Fiesta blend. This is the, my favorite one to get um, because it is finely shredded. I don't like to, I barely like eating cheese. Uh, it just depends on what or how. And it has to be like super, super thin cut. Um, then over here, I got some beef chorizo. My husband eats it eh, every, every now and then. So it does last a little while. Um, then I ended up getting these two because I like to make, um, I like to make like a little bowl of, I just put like, um, yogurt. I add some granola, the oats and honey granola, and then I add, uh, like slices of strawberries. So I've been eating that lately. I love it. It tastes really, really good. You guys should try it. And I, I eat it for like a snack, you know, I'm trying my best, you know, to not binge eat on, you know, not healthy snacks. So I'm trying to get, you know, eat something a little different. I also got the light Greek vanilla, and this is a plain one. Okay, I got some tortilla chips because whenever I make ground beef and I add shredded cheese, it's almost like almost like a Frito pie, but it's not. Um, I, we, we like to use these. Um, and then over here, I just got, I think, I, yeah, two cans of the vegetable because whenever I boil chicken, I make chicken salad. So, well, for me, nobody likes to eat it. Um, over here I got some corn because I do, whenever I make bre chicken breast, 
I like to mix it in with corn and I make mine like a lemon pepper chicken breast, something like that. Um, then I got some milk. So the whole milk the baby has to drink um, because he's very lactose. So I'm supposed to be getting the actual lactose whole milk. So that's the one he gets on the wick. So that's what I'm going to be. Um, I need to start getting um, over here. My daughter has been asking me for chocolate milk. So I got her that one. And then this is the one that we drink the 1%. But they didn't have gallons. They only had these. So I was like, you know what? Let me just take one. Um, and then right over here, I picked up some yogurts for the kids. These are expensive. Well, they're getting more expensive. I think I usually get the 24 pack, but it was like almost $10. I was like, man, like, I don't know. I'm like, okay, let me just get them these for now. And then we will see. Um, if they finish them, I guess I'll get another one. And then I got the unsalted crackers here. I got the um, Maple Grove Farms sugar-free. So my kids like to eat, like, whenever they make, oh, I make pancakes for them. They put, a, like, a lot of syrup. So I was like, you know what? They need to, they need to get the sugar-free because, you guys, these kids. Um, I also got the little, um, oh, I thought, I thought they were the same. Okay, so these are the little stars. And these are the little alphabet ones. So they like, last time that I made the little alphabet, they liked it because... Um, they were trying to spell out their name and this brings back memories. You guys, whenever we were at my grandma's house, we all, she always used to make us these sopitas and we would try to spell out our names in the bowl too. So I was like, you know what? Let me just pick them up. Plus they're like 48 cents. So it's very, very affordable. Um, okay. I got another one of these. I got some of these here. These were, I think like a 198 or something. I think probably less. And this is the chocolate and vanilla. And then I just got the plain vanilla. These are really good, too, and it's, I mean, they are super sweet, but, you know, maybe, like, a little snack instead of eating, like, actual junk food, like chips, maybe get some of these, and then we already ran out of strawberries, so I picked up another one. I was going to get the smaller one, but they didn't really look like the strawberries were done yet, and these look, they, they look kind of, like, yellowish, reddish, and these look pretty good, so... I got one of these. I got some avocados. I just ate one. You know, I showed you guys right there when I cook my food. And then I picked up some salads. This is a Southwest salad. This is one of my favorite, favorite, favorite salads to eat. Um, I like the sauce. I just don't eat the whole packet. And then I got a Caesar salad. These are like $5 and a couple cents, I think. A Caesar salad. We got this one here. I haven't used tomato sauce in a while. I used to make my husband um papas con like papas con carne but then i used to add like the the tomato sauce or tomato paste so i got one of those and then i got the chicken which i'm gonna be taking to my mom's house because she is going to cook us some mole you guys i honestly i mean i know probably mole is easy to cook but i don't know i just don't know i don't know if i like do it right or i just don't mix it right i don't know but anyways, you guys, that is going to be it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to give it a big, big thumbs up, you guys. And subscribe down below if you guys haven't. Also, don't forget to go and check the link out. It will be in the description box. And check it out, you guys, because they have a lot of little cute stuff there in that website. And yeah, you guys, thank you guys so much for watching. And we will see you guys on the next video. Bye, guys.